Job hunting can be a difficult task, especially for those with disabilities. But as WHLT's Katie Rowe found out, young adults in USM's search program aren't letting anything stop them from joining the workforce. I think it has been a good, good year for me. The goal for these young adults is the same as any high school or college student. Gather the skills necessary to get a job. And although they may have extra hurdles, they don't let that stop them. These young people want a purpose, just like anybody else. And what we focus on abilities. If somebody's having a bad day at work, you need to encourage them, correct? The program is called Search, and it is held on USM's campus. It lasts for about a year, allowing young adults with developmental or cognitive disabilities a chance to learn different skills to help them get jobs after graduating from the program. Um, I can already see growth just in the first week, and by the end of the year, it's like they're different people <laughs> than when they walked in the door. Last week, seven students graduated from the program, and now 11 new interns have joined. I'm excited that I got, I'm here because I've been wanting to come here for ever since my 11th grade year. We do a lot of confidence building activities and activities um, that teach communication skills, turn taking. Um, we utilize technology a great deal. My favorite activity is doing my re resume. They will each complete three internships while in the program and some already have their dream internship picked out. Excited about my first internship in food. The internships are all held on USM's campus. Once they start, so does their independence. Connecting you to Pine Belt News, Katie Rowe, WHLT 22. And Project Search is a nationwide organization, but this is the only one in Mississippi. They hope to see more programs become available in more areas in the future.